Kyle Hendricks. Three and two this year ERA in the low threes. He's got excellent control. He moves the ball doesn't use the middle of the plate and he is tough to deal with. Tim Anderson first up for the Sox. Tim on the ground left hand side Bodie off a dive and Tim safe he beat it out. That was a great play by Bodie but Tim Anderson doing what he does best getting aboard early and he hit this ball hard. So now seven game hitting streak for Anderson. Here's John Moncada who had yesterday off. Anderson not running. Called strike three. Got him on an outside fastball. Cheers yes money Grandal. Change up swung on and missed strike three and that's out number two. Back to back strikeouts for Kyle Hendricks. Jose Abreu now strides to the plate with a runner at first. No score. Two outs. Well, I think right now this is the true test for Kyle Hendricks because Abreu is the one seeing the ball the best in the lineup. And it's a jam shot roller right up the middle into center field. A base hit. Anderson turns second on his way to third. So Jose Abreu goes the other way from the shift and is now first and third with two outs here in the top of the first inning and another hit for Abreu. He's now hit in seven straight as well. The batter Eloy Jimenez hits a pop fly. This might be playable foul territory. It is for Contreras. He's got it. And Hendricks puts a zero on the board. So Ronaldo Lopez making his first start since the third game of the season. Not exactly sure how long a leash that Lopez will have here tonight as being his first start back. Ian Happ leads off for the Cubs. Now the 3-1 to Happ. Very high ball for Ian Happ doing his job as the leadoff man getting on base. Let's see if that leads to bigger and better things. Here is Anthony Rizzo. And that's hit in the air into deep right field. Turning around now is Mazzara. He'll make the catch there at the warning track. One away and it brings up Baez. And the next offering from Lopez is strike three called right down the middle at 96 miles an hour. There's Kyle Schwarber to the plate now with a runner at first base and two outs. And that is strike three called 97 miles an hour right at the knees. So Ronaldo Lopez after the leadoff walk gets the next three. And Edwin has a leadoff double and the Sox third hit in six batters. And Luis Robert who leads the league in first pitch swings at nearly 57 percent of the time. And he does right here and lobs a grenade to center field and gone. First pitch assault and a two run shot. And that is just the way they started last night. It's quickly 2 0 White Sox here in the second inning. Ronaldo came out this inning and he wasn't the same pitcher he was in the first. Maybe it was the length of time between innings. Now he's got two on, nobody out. Now he really has to battle his way to get out of this. And Caratini has been swinging the bat very well. Caratini drives one in the air toward left. Back goes Jimenez. Jimenez still going back. It's over his head off the wall and bouncing away. Two runs are going to score on the double in the ball game is tied two to two. The Cubs have two runs in the first and seven batters tonight against Lopez. Two outs back to the top for Ian Happ in this 2-2 game here in the second inning. That's a high fly ball into shallow center. Right there is Luis Robert. One hand grab inning over. But damage done as Lopez gives up the two run double but does strand the go ahead run. Eloy at first base now with two outs for Edwin Encarnacion. Baez will throw to first. Again, that throw off the mark, but oh, oh look out, Laz. Everybody all right? What a crazy looking play. Oh, man, oh man. I <laughs> don't know how Encarnacion did not run completely over Laz. You know what? Laz's trip actually saved him. I've never seen that before. Laz saying a sniper got me. Laz is never going to hear the end of this. 2 2 as we head to the top of the sixth inning, and Jose Abreu will lead it off. Jose to right field. Well struck. Very well struck and out of here. Bring him home for the lead. Top six. And Kyle Hendricks disgusted with that 2 0 pitch right over the heart of the plate to the hottest hitter. Back to back sharp singles here in the White Sox seventh inning. They already lead by a run, and the batter now is Tim Anderson. Anderson hits a ground ball to short. Baez goes to second. There's one. Kipnis to first. That's a double play. Just what the Cubs needed. 6 4 3 on the twin killing. So runner at third with two outs, and it brings up Moncada. Moncada hits a high pop fly. Playable. Baez behind second is calling. In very shallow center, he'll make the catch. And that ends the inning. Good job by Ryan Tapera. Gio Gonzalez, who's been in since the fourth inning, he got the final two outs of the fourth, and then got double plays in the fifth and sixth to close out the Cubs. You would think he's out there on a very short leash at this point. Two gone, it will bring up Jason Kipnis. Down low, he walked him, and Gonzalez is mad at himself. This means he has to face David Bodie now with a guy on base. 
Renteria has not yet made the call. Is Renteria going to stay with Gonzalez here? I, I believe he, he will. That's a high fly ball into left field. Eloy Jimenez measuring this one up right at the warning track. He'll make the catch. Inning is over. Good start here to the eighth inning. Lead off walk. And that'll bring up the red hot Jose Abreu. Rowan Wick. He has gone 45 and a third innings without allowing a home run. That dates back to September 9th of 2018. Oh, it hung. Jose in the air. Left field. Way back. Bring him home. A cement mixer to beat all cement mixers, and it's 5-2. to two. The homer streak is history for Wick. Cubs now have two men on. Okay. The stage is set. The tying run is at the plate. Wilson Contreras coming up. Bouncer toward the middle. It's going to be a base hit. Rounding third, heading home. Baez, the Cubs get a step closer. And now it's a 5-3 to three ball game. So here's Jason Hayward, and the pitch hit in the air. The straightaway center field. Luis Roberts got plenty of room there. He'll make the catch, and the inning has come to an end. Two down. Grandal coming up. Yasmani in the air, center field. Half is back. He's at the track, at the wall. Gone! A little extra from Yaz tonight. And 6 3, the Sox lead. Be nice for a three homer game for Abreu. Sure. He'd like it. And that's a high fly ball. Deep left field. It's a trifecta. Jose Abreu has gone deep for the third time tonight. Seven to three, White Sox lead in the ninth. And Jose Abreu is hot as we have ever seen him. And it is Alex Colome in this ball game. Cubs have men at second and third. Three and a half will come up. Bouncing ball to the right side, fielded by Mendick. He'll throw to first in time. A run scores, but now there are two down. And Anthony Rizzo will try to keep the Cubs alive. Center field, Roberts got it, and the Sox win a seventh in a row. And a chance for a sweep tomorrow. 